So, okay. I don't I don't know what this is yet. I don't I don't know what this is gonna be. I'm just trying something out. Um, I don't know if anybody's ever gonna see this. So here's the deal. I I have um, I've been running one channel for a while now, the Answers with Joe channel. I do have a Canker Boy channel that I've been terrible about keeping up with. That's what I need to be spending my time on right now, actually. But for some reason, you know, I get these ideas in my head and I think this is something I should try, this is something I should do. And I've been thinking a lot about doing something more like this. So it's, it's like an actual daily vlog or, or like a, a daily video journal kind of thing. And I don't know why anybody would watch this. <laughs> and I don't know what this is gonna be. I, I'm, I'm, literally, um, I'm literally just winging this. And, I, and this is gonna be the first video. I was gonna put it up on there and then there's gonna be another one and then there's gonna be another one and maybe over time this will become a thing I don't know and I I don't know how many people are gonna follow me over here I don't know if I'll ever even talk about this if you are watching this I don't I don't I, I'm really curious who's gonna be the first person to comment in a video about this if there's anybody watching this I don't know if it's I don't know if it's nice or if I'm, I'm really feeling sad for you that you're spending your time watching this anyway uh, so here's what's going on in my life, and here's why I started thinking this would be a good idea to do this. I am officially at a place where YouTube has become my job, kind of like this is this is what I this is what I do now. Um, it was always a hobby, you know. I I the first couple of years that I was I was doing this, when I say full time, what I mean is I've been uploading once a week regularly for um, since uh, the fall of 2014 so I guess it'd be three years now and um, anyway I worked a full-time job during that whole time and then the last year I've also been working full-time but I've been working from home so it's given me a lot more flexibility to do more and work more on this channel uh, and I think it's really paid off I mean just look at look at the numbers on the channel it's been incredible it's been an incredible year but um, I'm at a place now where I've actually gone from full-time to part-time at my job. This is expected to be temporary, but I gotta be honest, I'm kind of enjoying this <laughs> because I'm literally I'm literally living off of my YouTube channel and it's and it's become a whole thing. So what wound up happening, what I started doing this week was for the first time I started prioritizing the YouTube channel over everything else I've got going on and, and those who know me know I've always got a lot of stuff going on but I, I literally started prior prioritizing the YouTube channel over all of that so the, the thing I've been doing this week well back up just a little bit the one that I did on uh, Monday that I released on Monday that was the life extension technology one <laughs> I'm not lying I recorded that Sunday evening at 6 or 7 o'clock and then I was up all night editing it. And I am now at a place where I have several different sources of revenue from YouTube. I have sponsorships coming in. And those sponsorships usually need the videos done like a week ahead of time so that they can approve them. It's a whole new workflow. It's a whole new level of professionalism that I need to, to be uh, performing at. And pulling all-nighters on Sunday night and then getting up and working in the morning, not cool. Not the way to go. And I, I was doing it and I was like, I, can't, I cannot do this anymore. This has to stop. I, I have to find a way to, to break this habit because that happens way too often. And the bottleneck, the thing that's always slowing me up, slowing me up, slowing me down, keeping me up, whatever, is, is the writing. It's always the writing. The, the shooting and the editing, that takes its own amount of time, but it's, it's the writing. And the reason why the one this last week got so slowed down or held back or whatever don't know my metaphors right now it was because I didn't start writing it until like Thursday that was the, that was the first time I had a chance to do it because every single day I was like I'll put take care of all this stuff and I'll work on the script when I'm done well all this stuff never got done so I never got to the script until it was too late and then I'm pulling all-nighters and I can't do that anymore I just can't so starting this week I've been prioritizing every single morning um, and it's Thursday, so I've done it four days in a row. Impressive for me. Um, first thing I do when I get up, I make breakfast, I drink some coffee, or I make some coffee, and then I sit down and I start writing 
video scripts. I've, I've been doing it for one week. My plan is for that to be my, my regular thing from now on. And I think part of why I want to do this and what I'm thinking I'm going to do here, I guess I haven't even talked about that yet, is to just do this, just record myself talking using OBS in sort of a daily journal kind of thing. Um, and talk about the scripts that I'm working on, talk about what I did that day. It's almost like an accountability thing to nobody in the beginning. But, um, but I, I'm not gonna put, obviously I'm not gonna put that on my main channel, nobody wants to see that. So I'm starting the second channel and we'll see how this goes. I, uh, my, my hope is now I can get up in the morning, do some writing and then do something like this, talk a little bit about what I'm working on, talk a little bit about what's going on with the channel, maybe give some thoughts on the, the news of the day. Uh, I'm always trying to think of ways that I can talk about things that don't really relate to the topics in the channel. I don't want to start throwing things at people that are going to be like, whoa, you're talking about topics that I, I'm not all that interested in or I don't know why you're doing that here. Um, you know, what's working on the channel is working and I don't need to screw with that. So here's a more unfiltered, just me talking with the webcam, with Mr. Microphone, and, um, and it's just gonna be me just kind of putting out there what is going on with the channel, what's going on with me, my thoughts on things. I don't know how long is it gonna be. I don't know how entertaining these things are gonna be. Um, I don't know if I'll ever promote this. Right now, this is like the secret, secret channel. <laughs> Um, and I'll probably be secret secret for a while now. That's why I'm saying whoever is the first person to actually watch this video means there, there's probably gonna be at least 10, 15, maybe even 20 or more videos before I ever even tell anybody that I'm doing this. So somebody is going deep in the archives to watch this video. I feel for you, you need help. Uh, I don't know, whoever you are, I don't know. Tell me in the comments, you have my love forever anyway so I guess that's what this first video is going to be is just saying what this thing is and um, it's obviously a very uh, loose amalgamation of ideas right now um, and we'll see where it goes but um, yeah the thing that I need to fix right now and figure out is I need a new camera that's a problem I need a new camera because my current one, my Canon 7D, which is a fine camera, I, I love this camera for what it does, but it's not a good webcam camera. Like what I need is a camera that I can connect right into my computer and record. I mean, so right, right now I'm using Mr. Webcam up here and it's, you know, it's just, I mean, it's so wide I can't fix anything and you can see all and it's crap. So what I want is to get like a legit DSLR type camera that I can use as a webcam and just record right here on OBS so that I don't have to, you know, I could do that for all of my videos. I could do that for my Monday videos and my Kanker Boy videos and it, it could all be cohesive and all I have to do is just push the thing and start recording and then I have the recording and then I edit it. That sounds so beautiful. I want that. So, um, that's my next thing that I really need to figure out is to get a new camera. Another problem with this one, and I just finished recording some videos, uh, is that it overheats. It's not made for video. It does good video, but it's not made for video. So it overheats after 15, 20 minutes or something like that of, of recording. And especially when I'm on the second floor and I turn the AC off and I got lights all around it, it does get pretty hot in here. But that thing just cooks, and um, that's no good. That's no bueno because it's uh, it keeps me from being able to work. I have to. I literally have to turn off the camera. Sometimes I actually get an ice pack and put it on it, and then go away for a while. It breaks my flow, and 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 some of these these scripts that I'm writing and that I'm working on, you guys hear me speaking it. I hope I make it sound effortless. It's not. Some of them, I'm just like. I write them and then I sit down to record them. I'm like, what was I thinking? I can't, how, I, how what was I thinking? I can't read this. Like, I can't memorize all this. I don't have a teleprompter. I, I read the script here and then I look up at the camera and I do it up there. 
and and sometimes it's impossible sometimes it is literally impossible and and I, I might get into a flow it's just like bing 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 it's like nice you know some days I can sit down and record and it's just it's fun and then other days it is just I mean I don't share the behind the scenes like outtakes and stuff but I mean there there are days when I'm just throwing things man it's it's so it's such a grind <laughs> it's such a grind I don't know why I do this to myself but um, hopefully I can figure out a solution that would make it all a lot simpler but we'll see anyway uh, I guess I'll leave this one at that I don't have any kind of closing statement I don't have any love you guys take care on this although I knew whatever but um, I don't know we'll see where this goes if you're watching this you are a true fan and I appreciate you um, I don't know we'll see what happens rambling now peace out